So on we go to, uh, the, I think I'm going to do the, the little pyramid-y thing here next on those. Uh, starting with some of our darker areas. Real dark area, this one over here. Cast shadow area over here is pretty dark as well. I'm probably going to begin with this one right here. Um, uh, this cast shadow is darker than this one, so we'll do some fun things there. Remember, we always start with the dark and work towards the light on those. So this is my dark value here. So I'm going to start with that. And here we go. Going to just start dabbing in and forming up the edge between the two value things. Like I said, this area back here is mostly this darker, this darker blue. This is my 0% light. And it's going to be darkest right along the edge here. Obviously, if you're a little ahead, forge on ahead, that's a good thing to do. If you're a little behind, just keep plugging away at it. Eventually, you're going to get caught up and you're going to be set. Okay, so this is mostly this darker value. So, let's see. what I'm, I'm going to take it right here. Just fill this, this part in a little bit more. Remember I said it does have some transparent qualities to it. And also, you may notice that depending on, on what you're going and how the light reflects off something, like you'll see this side here that looks way darker or way lighter than the other one. It has a lot to do with the brush strokes on that one. Okay, I'm going to take a little bit of a turn like that because I know you guys can handle it. And then I need to get this side right here. To, to make one? Yeah. Okay, I we're gonna I have it on my video. Okay, we're gonna do a pause here. Hold on.